All right, you guys, I'm back to do a quick braces update. I put on my braces in July. It is now October, and I've gone in twice now. They put in some steel ties and a couple of power chains, and it's been, it's been pretty painless so far. Ever since I first put them on, when they changed the wire, it wasn't, too, it wasn't even close as bad as the first time I put them on. Some problems I've been running into is actually finding appointments. I had to reschedule my appointment recently, and the next available appointment was like two weeks after my original appointment. Now my appointment is in the middle of the day, so it kind of screws up my work schedule. So that's something I need to figure out. I like my orthodontist so far. It's just finding that availability is kind of hard right now. I changed the color. So I, I, I'm with this gray right now. I kind of like the way it looks. That blue looked kind of weird, I thought, but I'm sticking with this gray. It kind of blends in with the metal. I've seen some noticeable changes in my teeth. Especially this, this tooth is probably the worst. And it's getting lined up with these, these two right here. So, kind of turning that way. And my front two teeth aren't really turning. They're still kind of caved in or flat a little bit. They gotta get turned out. But it's going well so far. Kind of a painless process right now. There's some inconveniences with braces, obviously. Wherever I go, I always need to keep those metal um, things that you stick in between your braces to take out the food. And whenever I eat, I always have to rinse my mouth and use that thing and brush, and brush my teeth after every meal. Before, I used to brush and floss twice a day. Now it's after every meal. One of the hardest things to do while you have braces, I found, is flossing. You get this, uh, I don't know what it's called, some kind of, you just tie it to the floss and it's called like a threader or something like that. And you need to literally thread it through the braces and then floss and you need to do that in, on each tooth. So it's, that's probably the hardest thing when you have braces. There are certain foods that I can't eat or I need to be careful with. Things that you need to bite into, like I don't, I don't eat apples anymore. Sometimes hard pizza crust is kind of tricky. Um, sandwiches with hard bread. So stuff like that you need, to, you need to pay attention to. When you put on braces, there's a lot of people that they'll, they'll be talking to you and like five minutes later, five minutes after you start talking, they'll be like, did you put on braces? And it's just kind of weird. I did, recently went to a wedding and there was a bunch of my friends that I seen and they're like, you put on braces? And I was like, yep, kind of interesting. Especially if you're an adult, it's not normal for people to have braces, but I think it's becoming more of a common thing. When you put on braces, you start to notice other people with braces, especially people your age. It's like when you get a yellow car, you notice all the other people with yellow cars. Not bad so far. Here's another close-up of my teeth. So, I don't know, mainly these three. Someone from the last video commented and asked when I'm putting on braces on the bottom row of my teeth. And I'm not because they're relatively straight. I don't know if you can tell from the video, but they're they're pretty straight. Uh, they're not perfect, but I don't I wouldn't want to spend extra money for the bottom. I think they're as close to straight as you can get without braces. Well, yeah, pretty good so far. Hopefully, I don't get any cavities. It's a little harder to clean your teeth when you have braces. Actually, a lot harder. It's a pain in the ass to floss. I can tell you that. Oh, and since it's such a pain in the ass to floss, uh, today my Girlfriend picked up a water pick for us. I guess on my next video, I'll tell you guys how that goes. So I put on some steel ties and power chains. With the steel ties, sometimes my tongue will get caught on it a little bit, but that's pretty rare. The um, orthodontic assistant told me that if the steel ties get out of place, then just take like a, a pen or something and move it back under the arch wire. So yeah, if you get steel ties, just watch out, make sure they're not poking you. I started to notice changes in my teeth about a month in from having my braces put on. So if you guys are wondering about that, about a month in, that's when my teeth started shifting. Thanks for watching guys, and I'll see you next time.